looking around the internet and I found this photograph. I have no idea who this gentleman is, um, but I liked how the water looked. I liked how the tree looked and the background, but it was obviously not wintertime. And I said, hey, I'm going to take this and use this as my reference, and I'm going to create a winter scene out of it. So there you have it. Okay, so one of the keys to success for a painting like this is to use a lot of masking fluid. And, uh, and I showed masking fluid as part of what I used at the beginning, uh, part of the tools that I used to create this painting. But it's, I used drawing gum uh, by PBO. And uh, so what it does, basically, it, it preserves the white paper behind the paint. So um, I've reached a point now in the painting where it's uh, time to remove all of that. And I've seen a lot of fancy ways to do it. The best way I find to use my finger. So I'm going to go ahead now and just rub it off. And uh, what it is, is it's, it's liquid rubber that dries on the paper and just preserves that as you can see. So the final trick for this painting is rays of sunlight. And how you do that is with Magic Eraser. So I'm going to streak across the paper. Here we go. <laughs> 